Guys, so I'm back tonight with um, my other dog, Huck. Come here, Huck. And we're going to cut his nails, which are white. So to give you guys a little bit of a different uh, idea here. So his feet are a little bit dirty because he's been outside and it's pretty muddy out there. So his nails here. Sorry. Okay, buddy. Lay down. Good boy. Okay, stop. Yeah, we'll use this foot now. So his nails are white. So you can sort of see the quick in his nails. So it'll be the pink. I can't see very well because of the light. But there's a little bit of a pink line in his nails there. And that is the quick. Uh, and this one here, you can actually see the V part that I was talking about last night. Um, gonna... Stop. That's probably really upside down for you guys. It's not focusing very well. But there's like the V part, and you can see the line underneath his nails, uh, which is the quick growing. So we're just going to take his nails, hold his paw firmly, so yeah, you can sort of see where it's dark, which is where his quick is growing. Camera doesn't want to stay up today. And I usually do the dog's nails about once a month. That one was, I just did a little shorter on that one because his vein, oops, you can see the, the vein in there, anyways, and I didn't mention dew claws last night, so last night dew claws are the claws that are up on their legs usually, the, sometimes dogs have them in the, on their back paws as well, um, small dogs like Shih Tzus or, um, Maltese, Lasso Apsos, um, or even small mixed breeds. If they have the dew claws at the back, sometimes you'll see them that they curl. Um, and then that makes it difficult to get the either type of clippers in there to cut the curl nails once they've curled. Huck, it's okay. So what you want to do, or was what I was taught, was you want to get a pair of um, cuticle trimmers from the drugstore. And they work. You can stick them usually into the curl of the nail. And you can cut the nail so it comes uh, the curl part the really tightly curled stuff comes off and then you can go to using your uh, plier clippers or guillotine clippers to finish trimming their nails back to uh, where it can go so huck's pretty chill here he wants to go outside and run around but and then i'm just going to do his black nails huck has all white nails except for one I believe he's got one black nail on this paw but, like I said my dog's pretty chill they lie down uh, when I do their nails usually um, it's just they've come I've started when they were all puppies well lady I didn't have his puppy but um, she was always really good to groom and just makes life a little easier than to fight with your dog when it's time to trim their nails. Uh, my puppy, who's eight months old now, um, is a little bit more hyper when coming to trim his nails, but I usually take him out for a good run or a walk and, or play with him a bit and uh, he'll cooperate for me. He also likes to eat the little bits of nail, which is kind of gross, so I like to do him at the end because then I can sweep everything up and yeah. Anyway, so Huck is ready to go outside now and go for a run and so there you go. Mm -hmm.